In this video, I'm going to walk around a Verbella team room and show you the basic layout. As you walk down the hallway, you'll see offices on your left. And you'll also notice they're on the other side of the hallway as well. Each team room has 12 offices. So it's six on each side of the hallway. In the middle of the hallway, you'll see different areas that are good for small group gatherings. If you notice the blue rectangle around some of these spaces, that's, a, that's letting you know that that's a private voice zone. So people that are inside this area will have their own voice zone, and those outside of it won't hear them. Around the team room, you'll see panels where you can drop images if you'd like to uh, throw in some logos, or some branding. And if you go to the middle of the team room, you'll see that there's also a waiting room that leads into a bigger boardroom. I'm gonna open this door here. The boardroom is a space that is, uh, can comfortably accommodate larger gatherings. Uh, you could have everyone, uh, all of your team room members in here for a meeting. You've got plenty of seats and a few screens to work with. So that's the core of the, the team room. It's the kind of suite of offices in the hallway and then the, the large boardroom there with a bunch of areas scattered in the middle that are good for small group meetups. Now to navigate around the team room, you can of course walk around, but if you'd like to quickly hop to an office or the boardroom, you can use the go to menu and find offices or just the boardroom. So there you have it. That's the basic layout of the Verbella team room.